Hi there, this is Greg. I want to do a quick uh, little show and tell of some of the latest things that I've picked up in my new uh, gleaning job. I applied for and I received an art grant about a month ago along with four other artists. And uh, to kind of um, make a long story short with all of this, as a group or individually, we get to go out to the uh, Metro Central Station, which is basically the city's dump. And we get to dig and glean for all kinds of things uh, for the next six months. And um, there is a stipend involved, but we all have to create at least... Uh, at least uh, 10 pieces of art from the things that we find uh, for an art show in September at one of the local galleries here in Portland. So um, here I am with just a few things. I've only been out uh, gleaning for four or five sessions so far. Um, and these are just a few of the hardware kinds of things that I've been finding. People are really throw out some amazing uh, treasures <laughs> it seems like and then there's a lot of rusty little things like this that uh, that I really like that I think I'm going to use I've got an old trap here a very nicely rusted trap that I think I'm going to uh, put into one of my pieces let me push this stuff aside for a second because I want to show you um, some of the things that I pulled off of a player piano that came in. Uh, <clears throat> somebody had dumped off on one of those old uh, foot pump pianos uh, from, uh, you know, from ages back and it no longer worked, but they hauled it over to our our artist work area at this uh, center where we go. I pulled out a lot of pieces that just look uh, just uh, really interesting. Here's, here's a piece that I was able to yank out and Here's another really interesting piece that I think is going to be valuable in, uh, in something that I'm going to make. And another piece right here. Kind of even a, a little bit uh, movable if I can get this and uh, show this on the cam. There's some bellows on the back here that move back and forth. Uh, kind of like this. Anyway. Uh, oh, there's a few other things. Let me pull this box over also. I've got, uh, you know, some of these old uh, felt hammers also that I got out of the uh, piano. So the piano was just basically one big thing, but we, uh, we do get right in uh, and do some serious digging in the other garbage also. Here's what I'm planning on doing. Let me pull this piece over here too. This is... Um, one of the piano pieces, one of the uh, player piano pieces that I've kind of reconfigured a little bit. Um, I've, uh, it's kind of hard to explain what I've done here, but uh, the, the, there's two different piano player pieces that I've kind of uh, glued together. I've glued these green felt pads onto these little movable arms. And I'm already working actually on my first, my first box. I, everything that uh, we find out there has some kind of potential and so I'm already picking up uh, boxes because of my, I, I, well I basically am a, an assemblage box artist, I love working within boxes. So this was some old case that I got. Um, I've, I've, I've lined the thing with some old mapping and I got the old mapping from uh, some more vintage uh, encyclopedias that I found and I yanked all the maps out of these encyclopedias and, um, and along with some other picture content so I'm going to use the, the, the mapping in this first box well, which I have already done. Got a little uh, subdivision down here at the bottom. I've got uh, some little uh, frames along the edges where I can put a sheet of glass. I wanted to encase the top part of my box leave the bottom part open, but I need to begin to find glass out there at uh, the Metro Center, at the dump also, so that I can uh, use that as a part of this project. So what I'm going to do, what my plan kind of is so far, I'm going to use uh, this first piano piece. I cut it down so that it fits into the bottom, my bottom cubby hole, kind of like this. Sorry about the shadows, I've got some bad lighting here, but I'll do the best I can. This piece is going to fit down into the bottom, and then we've got a rust, nice rusty old circular ring I think I'm going to put up here at the top. 
and nothing more complicated than another one of these piano pieces with the green felted uh, hammers inside. And I think I'm just going to lay this in here in this manner and then uh, work from there and then possibly, hopefully, not possibly, hopefully get my glass over the top. I change my mind quite a bit and I might do something like, oh, my old medicine bottle, I might put that inside or, or, you know, let me see, I've got another piano piece here. That This one doesn't quite fit, can't use that. I've got a nice old leather case that has some possibilities. Got some of these glass doorknobs that that, that that might work out well. I don't think any of this stuff is going to fit in here. I think I'm actually going to go with this other little piano piece and my uh, circular rusted item for right now. But anyway, uh, this is the beginnings of my first of ten pieces. Ten or more pieces is what we're going to be working on. So anyway... Um, I'll get back with you. I, I think I'm uh, going out to the uh, to the center uh, recycling center tomorrow. I'll bring my camera with me and kind of show you exactly what it looks like and uh, give you a better feeling for what my uh, new six-month job is going to be all about.